Airbus and Tata Group join forces to manufacture H-125 and H-130 helicopters in India, a significant step in the country's aerospace self-reliance. Tata Advanced Systems Limited will oversee assembly in Gujarat's Vadodara, creating jobs and technological know-how. This strengthens ties between India and France, following their joint venture for C-295 aircraft manufacturing. Indian Air Force Chief Marshal V. R. Chowdhury states that the upcoming Tejas Mk-2 fighter jet will serve as a stepping stone for the advanced medium combat aircraft, AMCA. While the Tejas Mk-2 offers enhanced features, it won't fully replace the 5th Gen AMCA, which incorporates stealth, supercruise capability, and advanced avionics. The Tejas Mk-2's development will transfer knowledge for future projects. ISRO successfully deploys a 6-meter magnetometer boom on the Aditya L1 satellite in the HALO orbit at Lagrange Point L1. The boom, stowed since launch, carries two advanced fluxgate magnetometer sensors to measure the interplanetary magnetic field. The deployment, controlled by a patented Kevlar mechanism, matched predictions, with all telemetry indications within nominal parameters. DRDO is developing an AI-powered electronic pilot for the Tejas MK-1A fighter jet, aiming to revolutionize aerial combat. The technology assists human pilots in tasks like flight control, navigation, and target acquisition, enhancing flight safety and operational efficiency. The Tejas MK-1A serves as the first testbed, providing insights for future iterations and potential integration into the advanced medium combat aircraft, AMCA, India's fifth-gen stealth fighter jet, for autonomous flight and advanced combat tactics. The Indian Army signs a 285 rupees crore deal for 100 robotic mules, replacing traditional animal transport in high-altitude regions. These autonomous machines operate up to 10,000 feet, offering enhanced endurance, improved reliability, and reduced risk. Aligned with the Army's initiative to enhance operational efficiency, they can handle diverse tasks, initially deployed in Ladakh and Sikkim. With broader applications in vision for disaster relief operations and border security patrols, the Defense Materials and Stores Research and Development Establishment DMSRDE, achieves a breakthrough by developing indigenous liquid fuel for the BrahMos missile's ramjet engine. This achievement eliminates dependence on Russian imports, enhancing India's self-reliance in advanced weaponry. The indigenously developed fuel undergoes rigorous testing for optimal performance and reliability in extreme temperatures, showcasing India's commitment to defense indigenization and technological advancement. Air Chief Marshal V. R. Chaudhary announces the imminent arrival of the first light combat aircraft, LCA, Mark 1A jets, with deliveries starting next month. The advanced Mark 1A variant, equipped with enhanced capabilities, will lead to the induction of a new squadron by March to April 2024. The Indian Air Force's growing confidence in the domestically developed Tejas aircraft is highlighted by the proposed procurement of an additional 97 Mark 1A jets, further bolstering India's defense capabilities.